dear parents students and my dear colleagues to this virtual platform to witness the inter class speech competition today i am feeling proud as well as privileged to welcome among us the alumni of acs today's entire event will be compared as well as judged by our own loving past pupils who are a part of the acs family it's a moment of happiness and nostalgia for us at present many students are doing well in their own field and some of them are well established in their lives today being with them old memories of theirs is fleeting in my mind their naughtiness their fights their arguments that used to take place in the class all i can feel at this very moment today's judges have also been participating in the school events during their school days our past pupils willingly agreed to our invitation to be the judges as well as to compare the entire event this shows their love and respect towards their alma mater we all know that acs is always open for its alumni we warmly welcome them to contribute much to the society through their very own auxilium convent school it's my pleasure to call upon ms pritha guha and ms sachi sandal our past people to compare the entire program ms pritha guha is doing her masters in english in st xavier's college kolkata and ms sachi sandal is a final year student at amity university noida and pursuing her english honors in bachelor's degree over to ms pritha guha and ms sachi Thank you Ms Ruma for your wonderful words. Hello to everyone present out here from Pritha Guha and Sakshi Sandal. Few years back I generally used to be on the other side of the microphone delivering speeches. Today is completely a new experience to witness such talented kids from this side of microphone as an audience and a MC. In the words of Joseph Conrad, he who wants to persuade should put his trust not in the right argument but in the right word the power of sound has always been greater than the power of sense speech is power speech is to persuade to convert and to compel people can create miracles as well as destroy through speeches words can make someone smile as well as break them into tears it can mend bonds as well as break relationships words can make a prayer as well as a curse so it's important to think before we speak because once the word is shot it cannot be brought back oratory has always been one of the most powerful ways of influence and has swayed people like an invincible force mark antony martin luther king jr barack obama swami vivekananda all have shown how effective oration skills can guide the minds in the right direction with the right pinch of persuasion today i'm looking forward to witness a bunch of talented speakers who will battle it out with the arsenal of their words and will put their message forward with the best interplay of words emotions and reason making this event a great success the judges for this event are Mr Manpreet Singh the past pupil of Auxilium Convent School Siliguri preparing for joint entrance examination and West Bengal joint entrance examination 
Ms. Chetna Singhal, the past pupil of Auxilium Convent School, Siliguri, pursuing BCom Honours in Salishian College, Siliguri, and preparing for CAT 2021 to pursue MBA. Ms. Supriya Lama, the past pupil of Auxilium Convent School, Siliguri, student of Humanities. Ms. Aditi Agarwal, past pupil of Auxilium Convent School, Siliguri, pursuing Bachelor in Media Science. It is to inform everyone that the best videos from each class is selected for the final round and that will be broadcasted shortly. The topics for class 1 are Importance of family or my family The best day of my life My favorite festival My favorite book or cartoon If I had three wishes, they would be The judgment criteria are Speech construction Introduction, body of speech, and conclusion, and it will carry 10 points. Presentation and delivery, facial and body gesture, use of eye contact, relax and stable. This will also carry 10 points. Content of speech, message of the speech, relevancy, meaningfulness, and clarity, carrying 10 points. Language. Use of grammar, punctuation, and word selection also carrying 10 points. And finally, voice, modulation, and volume of speech in delivery carrying 10 points. Without any further ado, we would like to call out the names of the participant from class 1A Ankita Datta, Aratrika Sengupta, Devika Datta, Kriyash Haldar. Niharika Deep, Pratyusha Shah, Riddhima Paul, Samriddhit Mandal, Shriyan Das, and Srijui Roy. Good morning, sister, teacher, and my dear friends. My name is Ankita Datta. I read in class 1A. Today, I would to like speak a few words about my favorite festival, Diwali. Diwali is my favorite festival because Diwali or Deepavali is known as the festival of lights. During that time, festival of Kali Puja also there. Diwali is one of the biggest Hindu festivals celebrated across India. Diwali is celebrated as Raw Rama returned to Ayutthaya after 14 years of exile. Diwali comes in the month of October and November every year. During Diwali, we light candles and decorate our homes with beautiful rangulis. We worship Goddess Lakshmi and Lord Ganesha on the Diwali day. We burn firecrackers and enjoy with our friends. During Diwali, we share sweets and happiness with our friends and relatives. Diwali festival celebrates the victory to truth and light over darkness. Thank you. Good morning sister, good morning ma'am. Myself, Arathrika Senita from class 1 and roll number 7. Now I am going to a speech about my family. Family is the basic unit of our society. I live in a nuclear family consists of three members. It includes my father, mother and myself. My father is a service man and my mother is a homemaker. They are very caring and supportive. They teach me good habits and help me in my studies. We celebrate festival functions together and also visit our grandparents once in a month. I am very fortunate to have this family. I love my family very much. Thank you. Hello everyone. I am Devi Gadatta from class 1A. Today I am going to tell you all what would I do if I have three wishes. First of all, I would stop the current pandemic situation of COVID-19. 
so that many innocent lives can be saved. I would reopen the school also to meet my teachers and my friends as I really miss them. The second one would be a magical power through which I can give food to the hungry people across the world. I saw a video some days back where I saw people of many countries in force to eat cookies of mud in order to fill their stomachs. I felt bad on seeing the video, so I would definitely feed them if I get a wish. My last wish would be to bring back honey to me. Honey was my pet rabbit who certainly got missing one day. I really miss him. So, if God would give me some magical power, then I would definitely fulfill these wishes. Thank you all. Hello, I am Kia Shaldar from class 1A, roll number 28. Today, I am going to deliver a speech on the importance of the family. The best gift card God has given to the every living being on earth is a family. Getting a happy family is a blessing because not everyone in the world has it. The pleasure living with the family, making fun with them makes a smile. The moment we think about it. My family is the world's one of the bestest family. I love my family very much. There are three members in my family. Everyone loves, respects and cares for one another. My father is a businessman. My mother is a teacher and I am a good student from Auxilium Convent School. In this lockdown period, after the online class of my school, I like to spend time with my father by playing cricket and swimming in the pond. My father is my role model. He is special to me than any other superhero because he can do the things no one can do. I also love my mother very much. She teaches me after the school at home and makes my study too easy to me. She makes me believe that I have the courage to be a wonderful, successful and a brave person. She always cooks delicious food. I love my parents very much and I am thankful to God for this. Before I end my speech, I would like to end it with a quotation. Family is not an important thing. It is everything. Thank you. I did in class 1A. The name of my school is Oxalium Convent. Here I am to tell a speech on my favorite festival. Indians are fond of festivals throughout the year and all the festivals are celebrated with love and peace. Among all the festivals, Durga Puja is my favorite. It is celebrated in the month of September or October with pomp and pleasure. This festival symbolizes Goddess Durga, who killed Mohishasura, which represents the ultimate victory over evil. A few days before Puja, people are eagerly waiting for this festival. Schools and colleges are closed during this time. Slavery and pandas are made in different areas. Durga Puja continues for four days, which are Shaptomi, Ashtomi, Navomi, and Dashomi. The best part of this festival is eating variety of food, wearing new clothes, and pandas hoping with our family and friends. Durga Puja brings all of us together in spirit of celebration, joy, and happiness. I love this festival very much. Thank you.
morning bang and put you session i study now blue cotton school class 1 section a today i am going to tell you something about my favorite cartoon my favorite cartoon is doraemon it is a japanese cartoon he is a cat to but in this color is white and blue he came from 10th century to help nobita and make his future bright he likes eating dora cakes his sister name is dreamy and She is yellow in color. Doraemon has a pocket where he keeps all his gadgets. He has many gadgets like the helicopter, angel door, small light, big light, etc. Nobita always enjoys using the gadgets. Doraemon is afraid of rats. Nobita and Doraemon are best friends. I enjoy watching Doraemon in my free time. This cartoon gives me knowledge about science and moral values. Thank you. Today I am going to present a 
speech and the topic is my family. My family is a good gift of God. I have a wonderful family and I love my family very much. My family is a my family consists of five members. It includes my grandmother, uncle, my parents and myself. My father is an engineer and my mother is a housewife. Both of them take care of me and love me very much. My grandmother and uncle love me a lot. All my family members love, respect and care for each other. They also share gifts with each other. My family goes for a holiday once every six months. We all love to spend time with each other after dinner. My family has taught me good lessons about love, unity and respect. They also taught me importance of discipline and good manners. My family is a sweet and happy family. I am thankful to God for blessing me this family. Thank you. The participants of class 1B are Arav Thapa, Asmiprita Chatterjee, Kritika Das, Pushkar Sharma, Sanvi Sarkar, Sayan Dhava, Shreyan Maiti, Srija Biswas, Tithi Shaha, and Tusarika Ghosh. Some other are 
very big school called Auxilium Preparatory Center. Big playground and lots of students playing on the school. At first I was feeling nervous but after a while I uh, became normal. My class teacher is very friendly. She told about rules and regulation of the school. I made two friends, Arushi and Sijani, who are still my best friends. After three classes, our class, our school was dismissed. After coming home, I was still thinking about the school. I will always remember my first day at school because it is the best day of my life. and all my dear friends. My name is Pushka Sharma. I read in class 1 section B. Today I am going to say something about the book I like most. Books are our friends. Good books improve our knowledge. They are the life and blood of the great minds. I have read many books but I like the Ramayan most. Ramayan is a story of Ram, the prince of Ayodhya. Lord Rama obeyed his father. Rama has him presented as model of piety and devotion. We learn Sita's sacrifices, her thoughtfulness and her faithfulness to her husband. The Ramayan tells us the duty of the king. The king sacrifices his love for son for the sake of dharma. Love between husband and wife, between brothers and stepmother has been shown in Ramayan. This book is written in verse by Tulsi Das. The language is easy. My reading it piece comes to mind. It is a symbol of what is good in life. It is my guide, my friend and my teacher also. I am proud of having such as a good book. Thank you. In the month of Falgun, he started this story 
Respected Principal Madam, Teachers and my dear friends, a very good morning to all of you. I am Sayan Baba, Class 1, Roll Number 53, Section B. I am going to speak about my family. We know that family is the most important thing in our life. It is a family where we learn many useful things very simply. I belong to a middle class family. There are 10 members in my family. There are my grandparents, parents, uncle, aunts, my sister and myself. My mother name is Mrs. Sangeeta Giridhava. She is a homemaker. She is very hardworking, loving and soft. She take care of everyone very nicely. She also help me in school related works. My father name is Mr. Biswajit Thawa. He is a businessman. He is very hardworking, honest man. My grandparents tell us values, interesting stories. They also teach us values like honesty, Maturity, discipline, etc. The environment of my family is very peaceful and happy. I love my family very much. Thank you. Good morning. I am Sriyan Maidi. I am a student of Oxia Convent School, Class 1B. Thank you. 
wears new clothes with a variety of food and sweets. Meet with their family, friends and relatives and go to bundle hopping. There are sounds of mantra, sihanai, drum beating, smell of incense sticks, create some mystic environment. Celebrations and Oscar begin from Sasti, the sixth day, Saptami, Astami, Namami, ends on Vijaya Dasami. It is also celebrated as Dasera. On this day, the younger takes blessing from illness and elder weddings, their friends and relatives. The idol is immersed in the river or pond with possession. Dunga Puja plays a big role in our life. It is related to our social, cultural and economy. Dunga Puja is a festival of commitment, joy and spirituality. and my dear friends a very good morning to all of you my name is Rija Vishwa I study in class 1 section B I going to speak about my family we know that family is the most important thing of our life I live in Shantinaga and Shinaguri there are six members in my family. There are my grandparents, parents, uncle and myself. My father's name is Kishor Vizbar. He is a serviceman. He is very hardworking and kind. My mother's name is Papia Vizbar. She is a housewife. She is very loving and My uncle brought me lot of toys and play with me. My grandparents tell us very interesting stories. They teach us values like honesty, like punctuality, like discipline and etc. Many times we go for picnic, shopping and watching movies. The environment of my family is very peaceful and happy. I love my family very much. Thank you. Morning respected teachers and sisters. My name is Titi Shaha. I am the student of class 1B, room number 65. Today I would like to speak a few words about my favorite festival. The name of my favorite festival is Holi. It is celebrated all over India in the month of March on full moon day. It is the festival of colors. One day before Holi, we have Holika Dahan which symbolizes the victory of good over evil. On Holi, we meet our relatives and friends and apply colors on each other's face with love. Children like me use organic colors, pichkadis, water balloons to celebrate Holi. On that day, we enjoy tasty foods, sweet items like kujia, halwa, etc. Besides having a great historical value, Holi gives us the message of love and togetherness. It fills heart. Good morning teachers, good morning sisters, my name is Tusarika Ghosh, my school name is Om.
Auxiliar Convent School. Anji Team Class 1, Section B. Today I will speak about Diwali. Diwali is my favorite festival. Diwali is one of the biggest festivals in India. This festival comes in October or November every year. It is festival of lights. Diwali is celebrated Lord Rama's return to Ayodhya after 14 years of exile. People watch it, Bodhendras, Lasmi and Lord Ganesha on Diwali. People light up their house by lighting the earth. Rangoli is a draw to decorated houses. Children brought firecrackers and enjoy this festival. Sweets and gifts are distributed friends and family. Diwali is celebrated when friends and families get united. Wish you happy Diwali to all and worlds. Participants from class 1C are Avinav Chandra, Adri Jadas, Akshira Ghosh Bera, Anora Angel Gadal, Atri Kundu, Demira Bose, Riyanshi Das, Satvik Poddar, Sriyangshi Chakraborty, and Srijani Karmakar. Morning to respected teachers. I am Avina Chandra of class 1, section C. I would like to talk about my favorite festival, which is Holi. It is the festival of colors and symbol of good over evil. Every year, Holi is celebrated in the month of March. Holi is the festival of joy. We start Holi with Holika Dehan. I play Holi with Gulal and natural colors with my family, friends and relatives. I, I eagerly wait for this festival every year. Thank you. Respected principal and teachers, I am Adrija Das, class 1, section C, rule number 3. Today I will give a speech on my favorite festival. My favorite festival is Durga Puja. Durga Puja or Navaratri is an important Hindu festival of India. It is most important festival of Bengal. The festival celebrates the victory of Goddess Durga over Mahisasur. Durga Puja is celebrated in the month of September or October. Various pandas are decorated beautifully and big idols of Ma Durga are installed. Durga Puja is celebrated for four days in West Bengal and these four days are Saptami, Ashtami, Nabami and Vijayadasami. Goddess Durga is a symbol of power, of Shakti with different weapons in 10 different hands. These days of Puja, I enjoy very much with my family. Every year, we wait for this Puja. People go to the temple and pandas or worship Goddess Durga at home with preparation and devotion. It is believed that worshipping Durga Ma brings prosperity and removes darkness and evil. Durga Puja is also a time for reunion of family and friends. According to the Puja ritual, Ma Durga is immersed at the end of this Puja. Thank you.
respected teachers, sisters, and all my dear old friends. Myself, Akshara Ghosh Peda. I study in class 1, section C. My roll number is 5. If I had 3 wishes, I could choose. First, well, we need hunger to have food for everyone. In Corona time, I noticed many people died as they did not have work and could not buy food. My second wish is to save and take care for people. For that, I would like to be a doctor. I heard many people died by coronavirus as they did not get proper treatment at early days of Corona pandemic. I like to make medicine in the new virus cup and treat with the medicine. My last wish is to fly and see the world. As I cannot be a bird, so I would like to buy an aeroplane and see the world with my family and friends. So friends, this is my three wishes. What could be your three wishes? Thank you. Good morning. The topic of my speech is my family. I would like to start the speech with this quote. A family that prays each together and stay together. I have a big family. I also have pets. My family members are my father, mother, two brothers, aunties, uncles, cousins and myself. I also have puppies at home. Their names are Kukulola and Kalla. I love them so much. They are also my family member. We love to eat together, play together. All my family members love me so much. And I also love them equally. With this, I would like to end my shorts. Good afternoon, my respected teachers, principal ma'am, and all my dear friends. I'm also going to have class one C. Today, I'm here to talk on the topic, my favorite cartoon. I love watching cartoons. There are so many cartoons I watch. But my favorite cartoon is Paper Pig. In the cartoon Paper Pig, Paper is a daughter. She lives with her parents and a little bird in charge. They all have pink colored books. Paper Pig is my favorite cartoon because it is very simple and fun to watch. Daddy Pig and Mummy Pig teach Pippa and George how to behave and how to have fun. Pippa and George have their grandparents. They live in a pretty white house on the other mountain. Pippa's best friend is Susie Sheep. Susie Sheep, Peppa, Candy Cat and Zuri Zebra all go to the same school. They play and study together. Peppa goes on a lot of adventures, explores and learns so many things which she also teaches George. Mom Pig and Daddy Pig love them and teach them lessons. When Peppa is rude, they teach her to be kind. When Peppa was angry, they teach her to forgive. When Peppa wants to have fun, they all have fun together. They are a happy family, which makes me happy whenever I watch it. Peppa Pig taught me so many things. That is why Peppa Pig is my favorite cartoon. Thank you. Hello everyone, I am Deepma Bosch from class 1, C, Roll 21. Christmas is one of my favorite festivals. I eagerly wait for it all throughout the year. It is celebrated as the Christian holiday to pay honor of the birth of Jesus Christ, who was the true reflection of forgiveness. It is observed every year on the 25th of December, the Thug, 
preparations and decorations. It is also celebrated by the non-Christians as a cultural holiday in the winter season. Everyone waits for the arrival of Christmas very eagerly. During this festival, we go out to shop for a Christmas tree with our family. Then decorate Christmas tree. Christmas cards with my family. Santa Claus visit my house and drops gifts for me in the middle of the night. People also offer cakes and chocolates to friends and relatives. We go on a picnic with family and friends during the holiday. People sing, dance, and meet each other during Christmas. We should celebrate Christmas with love. Thank you. Good morning, to respect the sister principal, vice principal, teachers, and all my dear friends. I am Riyanshi Das from Class One Team. Want to share my three wishes. I have many wishes. I pray. For me. As people are suffering due to COVID-19 from last two years, I wish that God will forgive our sins and take all of us in His loving care, ending the pandemic very quickly. I wish to see people of my country free like a bird and live a normal life. I would choose peace as my second wish. Peace is the one of the most important thing. In the world, if this world were peaceful, many problems would be solved and all good aspects in the world would develop. My third wish, but not the least one, to be an IPS officer, Ramshidash IPS. Wow! I should say this is my ambition than my wish. I want to be a role model and punish all. In order to save my country, my motherland, and thank you. Good morning, respected principal, teachers, and my dear friends. I am Satvi Kordar from Class One, Section C, Roll Number Fifty Two. Today, I am here to present a speech on my favorite cartoon character. My favorite cartoon character is Peppa Pig. Peppa Pig is a preschool animated series. Peppa Pig is a lovable but bossy character. Peppa Pig is four years old. She lives with Daddy Pig, Mummy Pig, and younger brother George. Peppa lives in a yellow color house on a hill. Peppa Pig has many friends, but her best friend is Susie She. Peppa loves to jump in muddy puddles. She does many activities like attending the play group, going for swimming, visiting their grandparents, cousins, and going to the playground. Peppa has a pet fish named Goldie. Peppa's favorite toy is brown teddy. Peppa is energetic and talkative. Every episode is based on some activities like going to Peppa's office or playing with the bubbles, etc. I like all the activities they do and enjoy watching their episodes. Thank you. Good morning, respected sister, teachers, and my dear friend. Today, I, Sriamshi Chakraborty of Class One C, Roll Number Fifty Six, is going to share a speech about my three wishes. My first wish is to make the earth green by planting more and more trees around us. So, in my every birthday, I plant trees. My second wish is to distribute clothes and food among the poor and needy people. Because they are helpless in this situation, and my third wish is to spend my school days by studying, playing, and making friends. That is the first time I will be going to high school, so I am very excited. 
Every day I pray to God to fulfill all my wishes. Thank you. Good morning, sisters and teachers. I am Shrini Pamukar from class 1C. Today I am going to tell something about my favorite cartoon. My favorite cartoon is Chota Pink. Chota Pink is a 9 year old boy who lives in a small village named Dhalo. He is very strong, brave and an intelligent boy. He is very kind and a good boy. He is very active, witty and a curious boy. He has many friends, but his best friends are Chuchki, Raju and Jakku. His favorite sweet is Latu, named by Tonton Mossy. Whenever his friends, King or anybody else, needs help, he always helps them. Sometimes he fights with kids and animals. The topics for class 2 are Why I love my parents Importance of sports and games How I spent my summer vacations Books are our best friends And value of time Without any further ado We would like to call out the names of the participants From class 2A Atri Adam Ayushi De Ayushman Das Barnak Kundu Devesh More Parthiv Chakraborty, Pradabdi Paul, Rombik Bhattacharji, Srija Dash, and Vidigiri. My name is Aishri Dev, class 2 from Auxilium Convent School, Shiliguri. Honorable principal, our most respected teachers, and my dear friends, a warm welcome to all of you. Today, I would like to share my thoughts with you. An important topic, importance of time. We all know that time is very precious and time is very valuable to all the people. Therefore, we should never waste time. Time is the key to success. Time is the most valuable thing in the world. After losing it, it is lost forever and never comes back. The success or failure of our lives depends on the work done on time. Therefore, every person should use time correctly. Many students get big success in the big competition. A student who makes good use of his time, he does not have any problem in passing the exam. Money lost can be recovered. But once the time is gone, it cannot be brought back. Time never shows pity to poor and never salute the rich. Thank you. Respected principal, teachers and all my dear friends, I am Aishman Das, class 2, roll number 14, section F. Now, I am going to speak about why I love my parents. I love my parents because of no reason. Love is not conditional. If my own love becomes conditional to my own parents, that over relationship will be a contract, not convenient. Parents are a great gift in one's life. I cannot imagine my life without them. They are very loving and care for me always. They love me very much 
and take care of all my needs. My father is Anil Das and my mother is Saroja Das. My mother is a nurse. She is working at Chiliguri Hospital. She is very kind and hardworking lady. My father is a businessman. He is also very kind and hardworking person. Sometimes they bring beautiful gifts for me. They take me out and fill my life with happiness and joy. They take great care of the house and cook tasty food for all of us. I am very dear to my parents. I love and respect them very much too. They have never created environment which made me to feel them. That is why I love my mom and dad. Thank you. Good afternoon my respected principals, teachers and my dear friends. I am Atriyadam from Auxilium Convent School. I read in class 2. Today I am going to present a speech about the value of time. Here I go. We all know there is a proverb, time and tide waits for none. Time is one of the most valuable and priceless thing in the earth. We should utilize our time for ourselves and for our loved ones. If the time is managed properly, it would help to the development of good habits to organize daily activities. Nowadays, everyone thinks that money has most value in the earth, but that is wrong. Time is more valuable than money because lost money can be earned back. Lost time cannot be. Especially in students' life, time plays a vital role. If the student can understand the importance of time, it will help them to manage time in proper way. In students' life, from going to school to taking tuitions, participating in extracurricular activities is not an easy task. So it is very important to teach them the importance of time so that they can learn the man to managing time. With that, they can also improve their skills Thank you. Honorable principal, our most respected teachers, and my dear friends, I am from Auxilium Convent School, Chiliguri. My name is Barna Kundu. I read in class 2, session 8, having roll number. 15. Today, I would like to share my thought with you on an important topic, value of time. We all know that time is precious in everyone's life. Most of us know that time can never be bought back, but we still waste it doing unnecessary things or doing nothing. They realize it after they lose it. Time never shows pity to poor and never serves the rich. All successful people respect the time and understand the importance of time in life. They are also very punctual. We have heard the proverb, time and time waits for now. A student who makes good use of his or her time, he or she does not have any problem in passing examination. We need to use our time to do some useful work so that time misses us or destroys us. We have to take it as an opportunity and make best out of it. Hence, we must utilize our time in the most possible, effective way. Thanks all of you. Good morning everyone.
everyone. My name is Devesh Mo, class 2A, round number 20. Today I am going to say on the topic value of child. Child is very precious and we should not waste it in any way. Likewise, with our own money, we spend but we can't get back the time we have lost. So this makes the child more valuable than money. Hence, we should utilize the time in the most possible way. A warm good morning to respect and principal, sisters, teachers, and my dear friends. I want to give you a short speech about my parents. I am Parthi Chakravarti. I am seven years old. I study in class 2 from Anglia Convent School. I stand here before you is because of my parents. Parents mean father and mother. They have given me the best education, time, clothes and much, much more. Parents are the God-given precious gifts for me. They play an immense role of physical, mental, social, educational development. Parents teach and guide us on the right path and spread between the right and wrong things in life. They listen to our problems and help us make the right life choice. Parents are the next of people who are living with us in our life. Parents are the school teachers. Grandparents are also considered as parents in our life. Love, the love and support of parents, a child cannot succeed in their life. I cannot imagine my life without my parents. They are everything for me. They love me and I also love my parents so very much. Thank you. A very good morning to respected sisters, teachers and my dear friends. Today, I probably Paul, student of class 2A, would like to deliver a speech about importance of sports and games in our life. There is an old saying, all work and no play makes Jack a dull boy. Sports and games play a important role in our daily life. They keep us healthy and fit. They offer us a change from the monotony of daily life. Sports and games help in character building. They give us energy and strength. Sports and games improve our capability. Sports are essential part of education. Education without sports is incomplete. There are many advantages of sports and games. They teach us the importance of discipline, importance of teamwork, and learn to cooperate with each other. We realize the importance of games in COVID-19 situation as we cannot go to school and cannot take part of outdoor games. So, we engage in indoor games such as chess, ludo with our family members. All in all, we can conclude that sports and games help in development of mental health and physical fitness of the body. Thus, sports and games have great value in our life. I wish you all a healthy and prosperous life ahead. Thank you and have a nice day. Good morning everyone. I am Rongi Pattacharji. I read in class 2, section A. Today, I am going to speak something about why I love my parents. I love my parents because, because they are my mom and dad. As simple as that. They love me. They tell me stories. They take me out to places when I cry. There is always my mom and dad. They comfort me when I feel sleepy. I love to sleep beside my mom. She sings me to sleep. I love to fall asleep listening to her lullabies. Dad takes me over to Kolkata to my tabla guru because I love to play the tabla. Papa is a busy man. Still, he finds out time to take me over to Kolkata. One 
because I love to play the tabla. I love to eat french fries. Mom makes tasty french fries for me at home because we cannot go out during this lockdown. They work for my better friends. After all this, how can I not love them? They matter. I love you then. Stay home. Stay safe. Thank you. Good morning all my respected teachers and my dear friends. I am Sita Raj from Oxygen Convent School. Today I give one good speech and the topic is book is my best friend. Life is not easy without friends. When it comes to books, they can be our best friends. We cannot feel alone in the company of books. We can learn many good things while reading a good book. When we are alone, we can always pick up a book and start reading to feel relaxed. Books are our best friend because they inspire us to do great things in life and overcome our failure. We learn a lot from good books just like a good friend. Book can be good also or bad also. But it is our responsibility to choose them wisely. Friendship with good books make you good person. Friendship with bad books make you bad person. Books teach us have dreams. Books bring us bring positive problem. Thank you. Good morning everyone, respected sisters, teachers and my dear friends. Today I am going to deliver a short speech on why I love my parents. I love my parents because they brought me into this world. Because of them I am alive. They love me unconditionally. They never ignore me, never hate me and always ready to help me and care me. I cannot imagine my life without them. They give every sacrifice to make me happy and peace. They are the real reasons of my success and happiness in this world. Now I will tell about my mother. My mother wakes up early in the morning and cooks delicious food for me. She gets me ready for my classes whole day. She takes care of my needs. She helps me in my studies and does everything to make me happy. Now about my father. My father works hard and looks after the families. My father is my best friend. I share everything with him. So at last I want to say that I love my parents because my parents is the best parents in the world. Thank you. The participants of class 2B are Abhiruk Mondal, Vihana Agarwal, Indrani Roy, Raima Paul, Radrasha Chakraborty, Shreshtha Ghosh, Srimoy Mukherjee, Stuti Garg, Tanirika Das, and Ushashikar. Everything with our money 
but time can't be bought. We can divide time by past, present and future. Past is past, it has already gone. We should learn from our past experience. If we learn from our past experience, our future time will automatically become bright. We shouldn't waste our time by doing unnecessary things like watching films, playing games, etc. We should not do these things. It will give a big loss of time. If we lost time, that time will never come back to us. We should do creative work like helping our family members, doing reading good books, etc. Good evening, respected sisters, teachers, and my dear friends. I am Bihana Dirwal from Class 2B, and today I am telling you a speech on how I how I spend my summer vacation. On the other, this time I will give us a chance to relax and explore new things. This time, holiday are different because it came a lockdown period. On this holiday, I have not I have not visit any place. I, I spend my whole time at home. In this vacation, I play many indoor no games with my sibling. I have a craft hobby, so I made many small crafts with it with the with the help of internet. I I made many drawings with my sister. I also help my I also helped my mother in many household work. I arranged my room properly and also manage it till now. I have followed all COVID-19 rules for home like regular hand wash, drinking hot water and using sanitizer. Teach my holiday homework in this time, and I and I stay with my parents at home. During this holiday, I have taken taken different experience from from for, of staying home with family, and I really love it. Thank you. respected principal, teachers, parents and my dear friends. I am Indrani Roy plus 2B. Today I am here to share my views about importance of time. Time is very precious in everyone's life. We should not waste time in any way. We can earn the amount of money we spend but we can never get back the time we have lost. We must utilize our time in the most effective Way. We should also use that time for the good of other people around us. Wasting time will result in regretting afterwards. The best and effective use of time is set goals, prepare work list, prioritize tasks and do it. People who respect time are able to learn faster and work faster. They become more focused and pay more attention to their work. So always respect to your time and never waste your time. Thank you. Hello everyone, I am Rama a student of Oxilam Common School Class 2B. Today my topic is I love my parents. I love my parents not because they guide me. They are always there to support me and always paved the way to work right direction but because they gave me birth. I love my parents not because they gave me good toys, best educations, clothes, 
whatever I wanted, but they gave me birth. First, we will start with my dad. My dad, my hero, he is very hardworking. He is so generous. Dad, he helps me when if I do something wrong so that I can correct myself. Now, start with my mom. My mom is my cook, my teacher, my nurse, my doctor, my wonder woman. I am nothing without her. The love and support they gave me. I will try hard to be the best child in the world. Thank you parents for giving birth to this naughty child. I love you so much. No love is greater than mom's love. And no care is greater than dad's care. Thank you. Good morning, respected principal, teachers, parents, and my dear friends. My name is Rodra Hatakravarti, the student of Class 2, Section B of Auxilium Convent School, Shilaguri. Today, I am here to share my views about value of time. Time is invaluable. As it flows on, nothing can stop its course. Time once passed cannot be brought back by any means. We all are allotted a certain amount of time in our lives. Hence, we must use it wisely. If we utilize our time properly, it will help us to have a bright future. Whereas, if we keep on wasting time by doing meaningless tasks, it can lead to failure. Doing the right things at right time is very important. We must plan all our activities to save time. We can make a timetable to revise our syllabus so that it becomes easy to study during exams. Spending our time with our family is equally important. It is said that time is the most precious gift you can give someone. If we look at the successful people in the world, we can see they all value their time. They know that time is an important resource. It is limited and not renewable. Hence, we must never waste our time and make the best out of it. With this, I end my speech. Thank you. Topic Why I Love My Parents Parents are representation of God on earth for every human being. For God would not be everywhere he made parents. I, Sister Ghosh of Class 2, Session B, am going to tell you why I, like all my friends, love my parents. My mother works very hard every day to make the ends meet and have given me many things. She is the one who has always helped me out in studies. My father also works hard and both of them look after me whenever I fall sick. Whenever I am in trouble, it is my parents who help me and when no one is there to support me, I find my parents to help me through it with all their support. My parents try to provide everything I need for myself. Be it educational, recreational or something related to my daily life. In their busy schedule, they try to find some time and spend it with me. They take me to visit various places and sometimes in the hills, sometimes to sit 
River City. My parents once took me to Delhi to my aunt's place. We enjoyed a lot. In this lockdown, when no one is around, I find my parents for me to standing, standing beside me to support me. I love you, mom and dad. I love my parents. Thank you. Hello everybody, I am Srimoy Mukherjee from class 2B, Roll 52. Today I am going to tell about importance of sports and games. The importance of sports and games in our life is very great. Our body is like a machine. A machine cannot work without oiling. In the same way, our body cannot work properly without exercise and the sports and games are that source which maintain and improve a variety of skills. Games provide younger people with an outlet for surplus energy and result in increased growth and fitness in stamina, strength and healthy mind, body and spirit. Individuals who engage in games are moderately less stressed than those who do not engage in games at all. Sports and games are a part of education. It plays a very important role for an individual's physical and mental development. It is very necessary for every individual to take active participation in sports and games for an all-round development. Team games like football, cricket, volleyball, etc. teaches unity, discipline, coordination, responsibility and most importantly fellow feelings and thus make good citizens. Health is wealth. Sports and games help us to grow fit and strong and a true health is built and maintained by sports and games. So, we must acknowledge the benefit of sports and games that offer a good drill for playing the game of life. Thank you. Respected ma'am and my dear friends, good morning to all of you. I am Stuti Karg from class 2B, row number 54. Today I am going to deliver a speech on topic value of time. As we all have heard that time is money but as I think time is more precious than money. Even you can say it is the most precious thing in the universe. Once time lost, it lost forever and can never regain. Even a second which passed never repeat itself. So we should always remember the value of time. Time never stops, never takes rest. It runs all the time. We all are slave of time. It has its own speed. It never runs according to us while we have to run according to time. If we match our speed with time, we will get success. If we miss its speed, we will fail. So we should always work along with time and utilize it for good works always. We must remember that time and tide wait for none. So always respect time. Thank you. Good morning. Chess, 
badminton and helps the concentration level of the student. Karate or judo acts as self-defense mechanism. Sports also strengthens the immunity system of the body. Sports and games teach the student life lessons outside the classroom. Through various activities, a sports person has better time management skills, is patient, is disciplined, and a never say die attitude. Sports is not always about winning, it is about fair play and believing in equality and justice. It teaches us that even if you fail, you should never give up and strive harder the next time. Therefore, every student should involve in one game in life because who knows who has the capability to become the next Huni, Sanya Mirza or P.T. Usha among our students. Thank you. Good morning, respected teachers, sisters, parents and my dear friends. My name is Usha Shikar. Class 2B. Today I am going to speak about books are our best friend. Ernest Hemingway wrote an American novelist and short story writer. He once said, There is no friend as loyal as a book. Human is a social creature. We must be the companion. Books are the best companion of human. Books give us joy. We also learn a lot from books. Books took us into the imagination world. Books inspire us to work hard. Also help us to add knowledge. Books help us develop our thoughts. We are sorrow. Books console and encourage us. Books reading help us to relax and reduce stress. You start knowing about yourself. As you go on reading, it helps you know what type of person you are. Your deepest feelings, emotions. Books help to find meaning of life. Books become my best friend during lockdown. Good books make our life happy. But bad books spoil our life. Stay home, stay safe and read lots of books. Thank you. Participants from class 2 CR Abhishri Burma, Ayushman Das, Kaishini Biswas, Nilanjana Deep, Rishika Paul, Sanchit Das, Sneha Bhaumik, Shubhojit Chakraborty, Shubhaditya Bhaduri, and Tanisha De.
read books and gain more knowledge from it. Stay home, stay safe. Thank you. Good morning, respected teachers, sis parents, sisters and my dear friends. My name is Arjmandas. I am in class 2, section C, rule number 14. Today, I am going to tell about the speech of Who is our friend? Ernest Hemingway was an American novelist and short story writer. He once said, There is no friend as loyal as the book. Human is a social creature. We must need a companion. Book are the best companion of human. Book took us into the imagination world. Book reading helps us to relax and reduce stresses. Book inspire art and also help to add knowledge. Book help us to develop our thought and express our opinions. When we are in shadow, books encourage us. Good books make our life happy, but bad books spoil our life. Thank you. Stay home. Stay safe. Have a nice day. Goodbye. Respected teachers and all my dear friends, my name is Kashmir Swas from Auxilium Convent School, Shiliguri. Section C, Rule Number 24. Today, I would giving a speech on sports and games. I am glad that I got this topic because I am also a sports related girl. Sports and games are essential of in our life because they help us to physically fit and act as a good pastime. It's something beneficial that you can enjoy doing sports and games classes. This is because children need to adjust to hard physically work and get, not get tired quickly. People should discover and explore all types of sports and games. Good morning, respected sisters.
sister, teacher and my all dear ones. My name is Rishita Paul, class 2C. Today my topic is value of time. Tick tock, tick tock, says the clock. Time once passed, never returns. So how about doing everything in time? Sleep in time, eat in time, finish your homework in time and reach school in time. Punctuality means doing thing timely. When we reach a place timely, we can do many things. When we are late, we miss a lot of things. We make others unhappy by making them wait. A latecomer is never welcomed hardly. A student who knows how important time is for his life can succeed in his future. Time is the most important factor for the progress of human beings. Time is running continuously. Time once gone is gone forever. All successful people respect the time and understand the importance of time in life. We all should utilize our time in productive ways. Time is precious. We can never get back the time we spread. Thank you. Respected principal, teachers, and all my dear friends, a warm welcome and hearty good morning. Hope all of you are fine and keeping good health. I am Sanjit Das from Class 2C. Today, I would like to share my thoughts with you. An important topic. Value of time. Time is the most valuable and priceless thing in this universe. We all know that time is very precious to all people. So we should never waste the time. Time is the key of success. The success of value of our life. On the world, turn on time. Therefore, every person should use their time correctly. We should not waste the time in any way. Likewise, we can earn the amount of money we spend, but we can never get back the time we have lost. After losing it, it is lost forever and never goes back. So, always remember it. Tomorrow is too late. We must act today. Thanks to all. Good morning.
Hello everyone. My name is Shubhodi Chakraborty. I study in Oxium Convent School, Siliguri, from class 2C, roll number 55. Today I am going to give a speech about importance of games and sports. Importance of games and sports. Our body is like a machine. A machine cannot work without oiling. In the same way, our body cannot work properly without exercises, games, and sports. Games and sports are very important for both mind and body. Indoor games like chess increase our mental strength. Outdoor games like cricket, football, tennis, swimming, hockey, etc., improves our stamina. Each student sports and develop other qualities, also like leadership, patience, discipline, etc. Those games and sports keep the machine of life run smoothly. Thank you. Good morning, respected principal, teacher, and all my dear friends. My name is Tanshati. I live in class two, section C. Today, I'm talking about a speech on value of time. So, let's start. It is rightly said that time and child wait for none. Which rich or poor can wait for no one. We all are allotted a certain amount of time in our lives, and hence we must use it wisely. Time one pass cannot be bought back. Time is precious, and we must not waste it. If we utilize our time properly, it will help us to have a bright future. Whereas if we keep on wasting time by doing meaningless things, it can lead to failure. Time is more precious than the money. Every person who wants to be successful must must understand the value of time. When we save our time, we can, we can utilize it to focus our health and. Learning new things, spending our time with our families is also equally important. It is said that time is most precious gift. You can give it to someone. Then why not you give it to the loved ones? And yes, we should never waste our time and make the best out of it. Thank you. With this, we come to the end of this group. In the words of Mark Twain, there is nothing in the world like a persuasive speech to fuddle the mental apparatus and upset the convictions and debauch the emotions of an audience not practiced in the tricks and illusions of oratory. 
And with this, we have come to the end of today's event. I would like to extend my sincere gratitude towards our alma mater, Auxilium Convent School, Siliguri, for organizing this event amidst the turbulence that the world is going through. In addition, I would like to thank the principal, Sister Jaya Sebastian, and the vice principal, Sister Sangeeta Kujul, for taking all the efforts in making this event a successful one. This event could not have been successful without the hard work and constant effort of all the teachers and the management behind the curtains. Last but not the least, heartfelt congratulations to all the participants for their efforts in delivering their wonderful performances and making this event a wonderful one. Thank you.